So, I'm ready to go into everything. And, um, Brittany asked me to work for her tomorrow. Today's, today's what? Today is, um, Saturday. Generally, I'd be off tomorrow, but Brittany asked me to work for her tomorrow. And I said yes, which was fun at the time. But now I just feel like I don't want to work tomorrow because I'm tired and I want to sleep. And I just want to sleep. But... I already told her, yes, I'm not going to go back now on some, um, no, I can't do that. Because I'm the only other person there who could work for her. So, I'm, I'm, I haven't left out yet, but I'm really excited to come home later. Just so I can just go to sleep and be rested. Because last night I got home at 12 o'clock. My friend and I went to hang out. And we went so far, so damn far to the point where now... I'm just very tired and I felt like I didn't get enough sleep. And then last night too, because it was so late, when she dropped me off it was 12 o'clock. Because it was so late, um, when she was going back she was like, can I call you? And I just kind of figured, you know, we're both tired. Sleep is killing me. Of course sleep is killing her too. And I didn't want her to be out there and then um, fall asleep or something like that. So I'm like, yeah, and we just had one of the most random probably meaningless conversations because we were just talking just to talk so we could stay up which was so odd because normally we have stuff to talk about we have meaningful conversations and stuff like that but now um i'm just here i just had some cereal for breakfast and i didn't even have all of it and some peppermint tea i'm tired I feel like I'm literally slurring my words and stuff just because I'm so tired. Yesterday, too, I felt like I was going to fall asleep on the train. Oh, maybe I could sleep on the 5 train today. So maybe I will do that, but um, I'm about to leave out right now. I think I said that like four times already. So yeah, that is what we're going to do right now. I kind of got um everything that I had to do done in like a good time. So now I have like a few minutes to really sit down and do some of the most random shit, like, clean my AirPods off. Like, I love the AirPods, they're amazing. But then it's just like, you clean your ears too, but the AirPod, just every time you put it in your ear, it's just like, it's so dirty and you just feel dirty and I hate that. So, I'm trying to, like, wipe the case off and stuff. And then I'm really, really going to leave. I brought my Crocs to work, so it don't matter what I wear on my foot because my Crocs are there that I could, um... That I always end up putting on when I get to work. I don't stay in my in my shoes. Because I feel like. Um, like up where my toes are. Is a little bit wider. So it's just like. Anything I'm wearing for like a prolonged period of time. Prolonged period of time. Cases. Um, starts to feel uncomfortable. So. Um, it's good to like just take my shoes off. And put the Crocs on. And work for however long I work for and then throw them back on which is what I do during the days this looks kind of clean right now I'm really gonna sleep on that train today because I'm too tired I am too tired not to sleep last night my friend and I we went and got <laughs> god because I'm talking we went and got um we went to Applebee's and I feel like the last three times we went out the food just has not been the greatest. So when we went to Applebee's, take y'all up. When we went to um two two of the times we went to Applebee's. So the first time we went to Applebee's, the burgers were dry. And then um the time after that, the meat was like well done, so it was crispy. And then the time after that, um, where did we go? I don't remember where we went, but the food was not that great either. We were mad. They, the food was okay, but they messed up her order. We went to BBQ's or something like that, and they messed up her order. And last night, we went back to Applebee's, and they messed her order up again. Like, just the whole thing. And then there was some, some sauce on the meat, and it was not good. Me, I kind of keep it simple with stuff like that because I feel like I don't want to get something and then realize that I don't like it because then I'm going to be mad because the food is trash. But I'm about to run out right now. My goddamn hair is not covered. 
the ends obviously have taken some form of color, but everything else is just the goddamn same. So upset. I wanted to have copper hair after I wash it. Tavia killed my whole dream and I'm very upset. Oh my god. The, the ends took the color, but that's pretty much all that happened. I'm really chilling today. Nothing much to do. So, um, I'm doing a lot of self-care, you know, get my nails done. I just did my toes and then, you know, I did my hair earlier this morning and I'm probably going to just lay down and relax. I have some clothes that I need to get washed. Oh my God, I have some clothes to wash. Do I really want to go to the laundromat and sit down for two hours? No, because I actually like when the people fold them. So probably going to drop them off. So I need to figure that out i need to figure dropping them off out and stuff like that but um for the most part that's what's going on today watching philip defranco and watching this tati and james charles whole situation and i'm not gonna lie the the whole tati's video made me look at james charles james charles differently and honestly i absolutely loved it sorry james charles but now i just feel like damn you know like with all these things i don't know how i feel anymore so yeah.